Hey, Team Ignite Your Passion. <laughs> woo -woo. I just got off back-to-back um, -back calls with uh, some diamonds in Set Your Soul on Fire. Um, we have a diamond group, and we do weekly diamond calls. And um, I also got on a call with our Jen. And um, so I'm making this kind of late. But I was just thinking about per <clears throat> personal development. And, <clears throat> excuse me. I just ate, so hold on. This only happens when I make videos, I swear. Um, <clears throat> okay. So I wanted to talk about personal development and... I really want to I really want to ask you how you're actually how much you're actually doing um, and it's not just personal development like you are a badass is a great book but it's not going to change your life like drastically um, it's a fun book to read and um, I it helped me with my confidence and it helped me um, not take myself so seriously because I'm a very much like, I was really hard on myself at the time that I was reading it. It was um, my first, it was within my first year as a coach. And uh, it really helped me get out of my own way because I was just taking myself so seriously and really getting really hard on myself and it helped me push through that. Um, but that's not the book that changed my life. Um, the stuff that changed my life is stuff like Tony Robbins. Um, my The first book I read was Awaken the Giant Within, and that's what I got as uh, when I turned Emerald. And that book is something that started to change my life. Um, and then I started reading business books. I started um, because we're building a business. And yes, personal development and, and, you know, learning how to get out of our own way is very important, but it's not just emotional stuff that we're focusing on here. We're also focusing on our business and how to be a better leader and how to connect with people. So you really want to read stuff that teaches you how to be a successful human in society. And you want to learn from those people who have had success, like Simon Sinek, um, Starting With Why is a really great book. John Maxwell, uh, 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership is a great book. Um, I'm going to read it for the sec. I read it for the first time, like a long time ago, um, when I was in church and I, I, um, was a leader in the student ministry. I, it was a short period of time, like maybe a year, but that was a book I read then. And that was like five years ago. Um, Failing Forward is a great book. First Steps to Wealth from Danny Johnson is a great book. There's also free content out there like dannyjohnson.com. <clears throat> We're in the business of network marketing. So I want you guys to understand that. And of course, you know, as Beachbody coaches, we do not, we're like a different breed. We're not, you know, we don't come off like a lot of other network marketers do. And I think that's a good thing because um, we're just, we, we connect with people on a more personal level and share our stories. Um, but we are in network marketing. So it's important for you to understand what it's like to build a team and how um, and what to do and how to talk to people and, you know, how to lead people and, you know, stuff like that. These are the things you, you need to be learning about um, because you're not going, you know, you're not going to grow a six figure business if you're not treating it that way. You know, people go to school for, you know, four years, 10 years. Like I was going to be, I was on track to be in college for at least 10 years. And um, that kind of sucks. <laughs> but I would have spent all that time in school. I spent six years in college um, studying my face off. And if I didn't apply that same type of um, wanting to learn how to do this to that, to this business, I wouldn't get anywhere. You know, we spent all this time in school learning and studying and, and honing our craft so that we can come out and have a career. But we're in our career and we're learning as we're going and we're entrepreneurs and we're at the forefront of change and we're like making a big difference. But you're only going to make a, a big difference if you actually grow yourself. 
So you need to learn what it takes to be a successful person. I highly recommend plugging into Danny Johnson. I highly recommend plugging into Tony Robbins. Um, Tony Robbins to me is like the dude. Like he is, I went to um, UPW, which is his, his um, seminar, one of his seminars, Unleash the Power Within. And this dude is the real deal. And he's a successful man. And he mentors the most successful people in the world. So you want to learn from somebody like that. He has programs out there. And if you want to make this business your your business, your career, and treat it like you like it's your baby, like like you're an entrepreneur and this is your business, you don't flake on the site on the um at a sign of like struggle or um something changing in your life. <clears throat> I see all the time people back away from this business because they're like, oh, I'm too I'm too busy. School is picking up or work is picking up, and it's like. You have a million dollar business sitting in your lap and you're not and you're just going to put it on the back burner or you're going to quit because life is too busy like so many things have happened to Derek and I <clears throat> since I've been a coach um he's lost his job four times since I've been a coach <clears throat> we've moved multiple times um we've almost been on food stamps living off of like rice and beans and shakeology like broke and struggling and that is why I stuck this out because this is guaranteed this I have control over I have control over my business I have control over that stuff and like making it grow and like building a team and not quitting as long as you keep going and not and don't quit you're gonna succeed um, and I saw that big picture from the beginning and I was like I know that if I do if I keep doing this every single day I'm going to be successful. It's just a law of the universe. Um, and so I see people leave Beachbody when things get tough when I leaned into Beachbody when things got tough. And that is what you need to do. Like I struggled with anxiety and depression. Like even as a coach for my first year, that first year I like did so much personal development. It wasn't even funny. I listened to tapes and CDs while I was driving to work. That is all I listened to when I was making food, when I was getting ready, when I was taking a shower. And I still do that stuff. And, you know, I want you guys to understand that it takes a lot of effort on your part to grow and change as a human being. It doesn't just happen one day by chance. It's, you know, something that you need to put effort and time into. So if you want this to work for you, you need to really um, take personal development seriously. And like I said, it's not just emotional. It's like business and learning how to talk to people and learning how to be like, um, you know, somebody who's an inspiration and learning how to have influence and learning how to use your social media platforms, how to gain followers. Like think of yourself as the business person that you are and think of yourself as a CEO that you are not and not treat this like a little hobby on the side. If this is something that you are serious about, you need to treat it as such. And um, that starts with you. And, no, you know, nobody else is going to get you there. All the, You can have all the training in the world. We have top training in this team. And, um, you know, you can put yourself in the groups. But if you don't do the work, nothing is going to happen. Same with your workouts. You need to do that every day. Like, you need to follow the three vital behaviors every single day. That needs to be your priority no matter what. Drink your Shakeology, do your workout programs, and do personal development, and you and you need to share about it. So inviting people isn't just sending out mass invites and just like and adding people to groups. Like don't do that. You need to connect with people. So you want to con be connecting and share your workouts, share about what you're doing every single day, and be open and raw with people. And you know you'll get there. So. I want to hear what you're doing, what you can change um, in your business, uh, in your personal development, in your leadership growth. Um, are you going to get to a personal development seminar? UPW is going on in West Palm Beach, Florida. I know a lot of people here live in Florida. <clears throat> West Palm Beach, Florida in March when the Success Club trip is happening. I know nobody else earned it um, or is going to be getting on it, but <clears throat> excuse me. So while everyone else in Beachbody, not everybody else, but a lot of people in Beachbody are going to be on that Success Club trip, 
um, instead of sitting home, like really bummed out that you're not on the cruise with us, you could be <clears throat> going to UPW and, and utilizing that time and using that energy for your social media and using that energy to build your business. Um, so I really hope that you guys take this to heart and really think about treating your business like a business and looking at yourself as the entrepreneur and business person you are and, and you know, running with it. So I'd love to hear what you're doing. If you're going to go to a personal development seminar, if you're going to pick up a Tony Robbins program, um, if you're going to do Danny Johnson's 30-day uh, push, what is it that she has? Uh, it's a 30-day free training that she has. It's incredible. I listened to it over and over and over again. Danny Johnson really helped me when I first started. Um, it's dannyjohnson.com and, um, yeah, so I'd love to hear what your plans are and how you can, um, you know, treat your business like a business. Okay, good night, guys.